If you have tried to elevate your design in ARCHICAD's 3D workspace, you'd know how frustrating this is. Your windows and doors don't seem to follow along with the walls. And today, we'll try and fix that. Hi everyone, it's Nylan, and welcome to Naratech Studio. If you are new to this channel, I recommend that you subscribe and hit the like button and let's get started with this video. So I'm excited today, we are beginning a new program here at Naditech Studio and that is going to be titled HATS and that is Handy Advanced Tips. They are handy because, well, I believe they are and they are advanced because they're aimed at helping you stop the frustration and progress with your design and your projects. Let's go ahead and solve today's frustration with a hat. Does that even make sense? Well, hopefully it will. So we're back here in Archicad and this just happened. <laughs> I'm going to undo this because I elevated. So the example that we are using today is um, a model that we have gone through step by step previously on this channel. So if you're interested, the link is somewhere above here for you to check it out and make something awesome like this. So the reason why our windows and doors don't seem to follow the walls is because when you select this window, by default, the window is going to be referenced to a story zero and that means that this window is not linked to the wall itself but to the story so just changing this to something else is going to give you different results so let's see if we reference it to the wall for example and now if we select this wall and drag it up vertically by maybe three meters let me exaggerate this to show you and yes, now you have it linked to that wall. And that's all that you actually need to know. So, assuming that now we need to make all the doors on here. So we need to mark you here. Select all our doors. And now that all of them are selected, we change them from being linked to the story, but to the wall, either the top or the base, doesn't matter. What matters is you know that these distances will change. For example, if you reference it to the top, the distances that you will get here are what the distance is from the top of the wall to the door itself. So uh, just, I think I prefer to the wall base. It's easy to work with. And also we grab our windows, control A, just select the window, control A to select all windows, and then we reference all of them to the wall base. And now they have been parented there. So now if we grabbed this, if I bring back the grouping, and so that I am easily able to select this one and this one, I can now drag with control D vertically by let me say about two meters. And yeah, problem solved. So you can go ahead and start the landscaping around your design. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.